Hello and very good to all boys and girls. How are you? Welcome to another new video for the channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to get 120 Hz on the Play 5 with any monitor that is compatible with this frequency. Is that if your monitor has at least 120 Hz or more stay because I am going to show you how to activate this option quickly and easily, but before you start, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the videos with that said people let's go with the tutorial and the first thing you should have is a monitor or television that supports 120 hertz at least many current monitors are usually 144 hci or more which is perfect for this method however some monitors the years 2020 and 2021 did not work correctly with 120 hertz on the play 5 even if its specification said they supported it this was due to incompatibility with certain models. But don't worry. Since Sony has released updates that improve compatibility with these older monitors, and now you can enjoy 120Hz without any problem. Now we are going to go to the settings of our Play 5. And first from the main screen we have to select the gear icon in the upper right corner then we go to game settings. And here we select the applications and save data option now we go to game presets where we will find the option to choose between performance or resolution mode this is the key point you have to make sure it is selected the performance mode this is important because if you leave it in resolution mode it may not achieve the maximum possible fps and the performance mode ensures that the games run at the highest possible fps which will allow you to enjoy 120 hertz on the play 5 now we go to the screen and video section and here you can leave the resolution on automatic, which is the most common. Although if you see that it does not work correctly, try setting the resolution manually. The most important thing in this section is to make sure that the output of 120Hz is enabled. This must be automatic so that the Play 5 can send the signal to your monitor at 120Hz. It is very important that on your monitor, which must be 120Hz, or more you deactivate the free SNS or this is due to that the Play 5 is not compatible with these technologies and can cause problems when trying to reach 120 Hertz. Additionally, if your monitor has an FPS mode or game mode, I recommend activating it. This will further optimize the FPS rate and will help you achieve 120 Hertz in most games. It is important to remember that not all games support 120 frames per second. For example, Apex Legends does not reach 120 frames per second in Play 5. It still remains at about 100 frames per second, however. Games like Call of Duty or Destiny 2 work perfectly at 120 frames per second. So if you play titles that support this refresh rate, you will notice an incredible improvement in the fruit and the game experience. And that's all for today. I hope you liked the video and see you next time. Greetings and goodbye.